Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ratchet & Clank 3. My name is Hal, and in the last episode we did a few Annihilation Nation challenges and got kind of some cool stuff, aka the Terror Guys, where we can now turn into a weird alien thing called Terranoid. Hello. Nice to see you. Welcome you to the thingy. Anyway, so we're going to go into the ship. Uh, we also learned about something happening with Captain Quark above the Phoenix. Well, I wasn't really listening, but... All I know is that we have to go back to the Phoenix and uh, see what's going on. So let's do that. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and Helga. Welcome to the Q Force. You have been assembled here because each of you is an expert in your particular field. From Al's mastery of electronics to Skid's nerves of steel to Helga's sensual powers of seduction. Each of you has shown that you are worthy to wear the cue. Years ago, I single-handedly defeated Dr. Nefarious, but like a rash on the galaxy's backside, he has flared up again. Our first mission will be to infiltrate the Doctor's top secret base on planet Aquatos. Impossible, you say? Perhaps for a lesser strategist? Behold, my brilliant plan! First, Ratchet and Clank will descend to the sea floor and wade through a series of tunnels flooded with waist-high raw sewage. What? Please hold your questions until the end of the presentation. After infiltrating the base, our agents will split up. Clank will enter the base's ventilation system where he will locate and deploy this banana-guided autonomous monkey device. Or the GAMD. <laughs> Meanwhile, Ratchet will use his extensive knowledge of the Tyranoid language and customs to win the trust of the bloodthirsty alien guards. Finally, our agents will make their way to Nefarious's personal office, steal everything that isn't nailed down, and exfiltrate the base completely undetected. That's crazy! But it just might work. <laughs> I love that cutscene. I love all of these sort of, uh... Heads up, Al. Make it quick, I'm busy. Initiate plan nine. Yeah, when I get a minute. Oh, 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 there's a skill point where you can catch the monkey. Yay. I also love the, the sort of dialogue between these. But yeah, I really, really find the, uh... Shh. Um... The, uh... Quark's plans that always seem to be written on paper that he just seems to have found lying around. It's just hilarious. <coughs> so... Our mission, should we choose to accept it? Which, to be honest, we haven't really got much of a choice. Later, I'll do it after this planet. <laughs> it's only when the, these characters show up do they sort of the um, the intercom things, the speakers, the little bits of dialogue really, really come to light. So yeah, we're gonna head to Aquatos and uh, infiltrate the underwater hideout and stuff like that. Just generally go and uh, go and mess some shit up. Incoming call. Oh no. Clank, Bubby, you're killing me. Excuse me. I'm trying to make a picture here, and Mr. Big Shot Star is nowhere to be found. I am currently occupied with a mission of galactic security. Right, right. I get it. You want a bigger trailer? Done. You want a daily oil massage? Done. I need my star on the set pronto, capiche? Uh, you're, uh, breaking up. You know, I can see you, weasel boy. Oh, yeah? How about now? He'll figure something out. We've got work to do. Well, Clank's sort of being all, like, you know, offense, offended by that. You know, is there any of the galaxy that needs saving? It's nothing really. It's nothing of importance, you know. Just, just the galaxy. So, Aquatos. It's kind of wet. Hey, how did we get the ship underwater? How did how did that? 
Oh, big, big tube. Big, big tube. So, here we are on Aquatos. What new weapons can we get? If any. Ah, uh, Agents of Doom and the Sniper Rifle. Spitting Hydra. That's the one I'm going to go for, I think. Hold circle to target multiple enemies with the Spitting Hydra. Release circle to fire. Hey, this is a cool looking ship. What's this doing here? I guess I guess the uh, Spitting Hydra is a lot like the uh, the Raptor uh, from or whatever it's called from uh, Tools of Destruction. You know, the multi rocket launching thingy. Skid, what are you doing here? My code name is Shadow Dude, bro. Black Ops are my speciality. I figured you guys could use my help. Uh, thanks, Shadow Dude, but I think we've got this one covered. All right, I'll just take my hacker and go back to the ship. Hacker? Oh, well, you know, on second thought, I think we'd like you to join the mission, Shadow Dude. Awesome! This is gonna be sick! Oh, hey, I remember you. I remember these guys, what are they called, Amoeboids? They were a pain in the ass back in the Ratchet and Clank. The original Ratchet and Clank uh, days. But, as I said, like, right at the beginning of the LP, I love how, like, old enemies come back from the original game. Uh, and make a return, just to show that this really is the same galaxy from the first game. It's just things have changed a little. Not much, just, just a little. Like, for instance, there's now an underwater base on Aquatos. Ah! Anyway. Oh, sweet. No attack. Increased. For some reason, I'm talking like William Shatner. The jackpot crate multiplies all bolts and experience gained for a limited time. You've already told me this. You told me this last time I got a jackpot crate. Do you not remember that happening? That was a thing. What? Yay! I got one as well. Right. Uh, let's just deal with this dude. Quite easily so. Okay, so on this bridge here, so he's gonna he's gonna do his thing with this hacker. I'm gonna gonna open open the bridge, but we don't want to go over the bridge just yet. No, we don't. We want to go down here because there's nothing there. It's the second bridge, isn't it? Yeah, it's the second bridge. Damn it! Right. Anywho, moving on. Boop and boop. Huh? Hey, fuck off. Thank you. Nice to do. Now, if only Skid would use his hacker to open this door, because it would mean I wouldn't have to return to this level ever again. Because there is a platinum bolt hiding behind there, and of course, we can't get to it because Skid won't open it. Because he's a dick! If you could lock onto it, that would be nice. Thank you. Wow, we're really nearly at V2 already. Nearly, not quite. Ow. It's just not very nice. I like this level. It's it reminds me a lot of the first game. Just the way it sort of it looks. Well what good are you, you creep? You can't swim. Uh, that's where I found out that I've offended a load of my viewers who can't swim. If you can't swim, I apologize. For that comment. It's just politically incorrect. To dive or rise faster, your helmet will provide oxygen. At least, in theory. What do you mean, in theory? Now, I believe there's a skill point as well um, for getting all of these crates. But I might as well get because I want the bolts. But yeah, if you destroy all of these crates in the underwater sections, you get a skill point. Which is nice. It should be nice at least. Get all these bolts. And then get a skill point as well. I wish there was a skill point in life for gaining money. But then I guess that's just called food. Because you can't have food without money. Anyway, I digress. So. 
Oh, I'm getting a bit of a sore throat. Ah. So now we are in this tube. A lot of tubes, and it looks a lot like. Well, up, up the ladder at least. It's a lot. Down there. My scanners show a huge biomass moving towards you down the drain pipe. That looks a lot like my sinuses during hay fever season. Yay! B2. So what? We can now target four people. Yes, yes, we can. Let's get it even. Ah! King Amoeboid. Holy ta... Holy... What's where were ends in T? Tit. Holy tit. Yeah, let's go with that. Hi, Skid. Open the door. Oh, the door's already open. Wow. Oh, look! You can see it from here. It's not even behind you. I was just going to do that annoying thing and put me back on the top of the bridge before I get the bolt. Yes, yes it is. Crap. You should have just been... Pa I should have just been patient. Wee, wee, and we. There we go. Plat titanium belt number one of this game. Of this game. Of this. <laughs> Still getting my uh, vocabulary wrong. Terminology. There's quite a few in this level, actually. I think there's like five. There's. Because this level holds one. Like the only uh, mass collection levels, like uh, Tabora and Grelbin, I think. From number two, you know, the desert and the ice level. No, the second ice level, the one that's got like. Um, the one that's got uh, the massive wasteland in it. It's got one of those look like that. It's essentially. It's a sewer system. Which is kind of cool, but at the same time, incredibly gross. <laughs> if you think about it. It's kind of cool, but really gross. Uh, whoop. Get all these, and get all these, and open doors, get rid of that dude, because it's just kind of weird, having someone fire flames at you. Take this, Amoeboid Scum, and you, would be nice. Ow, I wasn't even shooting in my direction, how does that make sense? Okay, so, second water tank. Good to know, good thing to remember about this level, is that it loves the number two. Because on the second of everything, I believe... Have I got a bumper jumper? That's cool. I didn't realise that. Bumper, that makes things easier. Like, uh, controlling where I'm aiming in, while I'm jumping. Right, so, tunnel. Don't want to go that way. We want to go behind, because there is a platinum bolt here as well. Yes, there is. Uh, titanium belt, not platinum belt. Whoops. Um, uh, what was I going to say? So yeah, it's a good thing to know. Always remember the number two with this game, this level, because there's a tight in each of the uh, in the second one of both the bridge and the tank. There is a platinum belt, a uh, titanium belt. If I could get the word right, or you know, the metal, I shouldn't do chemistry ever because I'll just get all my elements wrong. All right. So, now through the little tunnel. Oh, these things have got nothing on me. I just swim straight past them. Get all these crates, because I secretly want this skill point. I wouldn't mind the bolts, because bolts are good. You get good. I could say you get a good, like, three or four grand from down here. Skill point. Right. We're back here again. I've just noticed that the, the trophies for the Ratchet and Clank collection literally are just the skill points. So, not only do you get a skill point every time you get a skill point, which is obvious, and really a redundant sentence. Oh, I just wasted ammo. Lovely. But you also get a trophy, which is nice. Oh. Oh. Boop. 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 There we go. And I got a sewer crystal. I'm not sure I really want to hold this, to be honest. I mean, it's a crystal from the sewer. That's essentially just a poo. 
Okay, so third bridge. Get rid of these guys. And go across the bridge. Yay! What? What's up, Shadow Dude? Who has a monobrow? Except he doesn't. Look, he has a monobrow, and then he doesn't. And then he has a monobrow, and then doesn't again. Weird. Right, let's see what's at the top of this lift. Uh, lift with a view. Look at that. That's pretty. That's really pretty. And. We are not alone. Hey, uh, dudes, I uh, forgot to feed my goldfish. I'll see you back at the. <laughs> well, if it ain't two of my best customers. Slim Cognito? What are you doing down here? I had a small run in with the cops concerning a suck cannon upgrade that was mistakenly sold to a miner. I swear the kid looked 18. Anyway. I needed to find a less conspicuous place to do business. I take it you two are still in the market. Well, let's see what you've got. Sweet! So, we get, uh... We've got, uh... Thingy weapons. Ratchet and Clank's two weapons. Just two, I think. Or I'm sure we had more than that. But... We can now check our hard drive for our Ratchet & Clank 2 save file, which we have. We have a Ratchet & Clank 2 save file, obviously, because we played Ratchet & Clank 2. Doi. Um, yay! You got some free weapons. So these are now for free. I was trying we got the bouncer as well, but that might have just been my imagination. So I've got the mini turret glove, which I just didn't use whatsoever. And we've also got the lava gun. Now the lava gun, when it upgrades, is awesome in this game. None of this crappy meteor gunness, but it ha was it the liquid nitrogen gun, which is essentially is exactly the same, but liquid nitrogen instead of lava. That's awesome. Um, so anyway, I'm going to end this uh, episode here in the depths of uh, the Aquatos Sea, um, and in the next episode we will actually infiltrate Doctor Nefarious's compound. Of the underwater variety, it's really it's a really cool view. There's not much. Oh wow, whoa, hello. I I guess that's that's the compound right there. Oh, that's that's quite it's quite. Mm. Anyway, until then, thank you guys for watching. My name's Hal Diamond, and I will see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>